a few years ago, we discovered that there were organizations that really didn't want to spend vast amounts of money on presentation workshops when they had a couple of executives who would have something that they really needed to work on. So we set up our Maximum Impact Masterclasses. These are masterclasses in which you can send an executive along, someone who is nominated, who has a particular issue that they want to work on. It could be that they're uncomfortable speaking to large numbers of people. It could be something that's hidden that is actually stepping between them and their audience on any given moment. We can work with this and very often we're able to give them what we call the felt shift, that they are physically able to stand in a different way presenting to people. It's very effective. It's an opportunity for managers and leaders alike to come along and work on their art. A secret language. In the room, it matters who you are. The old way of doing things that got you here no longer serves you. It's about power. Subtleties matter here. Every move you make, every nod, every frown, every casual gesture sends messages rippling out into the morning. Those impatient fingers tapping the table, the ringing of your hands, that glance at your watch, might just as well be neon signs announcing each shift of mood and intention. And under the table, your restless feet, so keen to move on, to get to an outcome, are making signals of a different kind, saying, look, it's just me. You don't have to take me seriously. This is the unspoken language of power, clear and precise with its own fixed grammar, its particular usage and vocabulary, its way of placing you exactly where you are. There is no phrase book. You're on your own. Your only guide is your practiced attention. Inside you is the wisdom of the watching child and the deep, dark learning of a million years. Sometimes I've found myself uh, writing a poem on the day about the issues at hand, and it's very interesting to see how a poem can open up a subject for people, particularly around the body. In organisations, we tend to spend our time walking around in our heads and we tend to forget that we are expressing ourselves with our whole body the whole time. This is an opportunity in these kind of workshops to be able to explore how we show up as an entire person. In the work that we do, you make a change, you make a step. What happens is that people get to the point where they feel different. If you feel different in your body, if you feel different in the way you stand, the way you breathe, the way you turn and move, it's very difficult to unlearn that. And that's why we call it the felt shift. It's as if the whole of you changes. You can never go back. The second thing that's really important is to get comfortable in your skin. The French have a lovely expression, which is bien dans sa peau, to be good in your skin. And that's essential for leaders, to stand up and say, that's who I am. I'm happy here. I'm happy doing what I'm doing. Do you want to follow me? <laughs>